Joseph Mark Cho Truman is an American musician, songwriter, composer, singer, and record producer. He is best known as the lead guitarist of the American rock band Fall Out Boy, as well as the lead and rhythm guitarist for heavy metal supergroup The Damned Things. Fall Out Boy began as Truman and Pete Wentz's side project from the hardcore punk scene they were involved with, and the band has scored three number one albums on the U.S. Billboard 200. With Damned Things on hiatus, Truman and Josh Newton formed with Knives in the duo released their debut EP Schadenfreude in April 2012 with Truman on lead vocals and guitar. It was released through Son of Man, the label he co-owns with Newton. With Knives played a few dates in the U.S. before becoming quiet and announced the project was on a break. On February 4, 2013, Fall Out Boy announced a comeback with a new album, tour and single. Early Life, the son of a cardiologist, Truman was born in Hollywood, Florida. He was raised in South Russell, Ohio before his family moved to the Chicago area. His family is Jewish, although he noted to JVIBE, I think we were more Jewish culturally than we were religiously because after my brother's bar mitzvah, we stopped going to synagogue entirely. Truman and Fall Out Boy bassist Pete Wentz attended Nutria High School in Inetka, Illinois, and Truman played bass with Wentz in a band called Armor Angelus. Musical career, Truman became involved with the Chicago hardcore scene, with his first band being Voices Still Heard he formed with friends. At the age of 16, he joined local band Armor Angelus and spent a summer touring as the group's bassist. He developed a friendship with the group's vocalist, Pete Wentz, and the pair discussed forming a more melodic band influenced by groups such as Green Day. Truman then met Patrick Stump in a Borders bookstore, and recruited him to join the band, which was subsequently named Fall Out Boy. With bassist Pete Wentz as Fall Out Boy's primary lyricist and vocalist Patrick Stump as the primary composer, Fall Out Boy reached mainstream success with its major label debut, From Under the Cork Tree. Released in 2005 by Island Records, the album debuted on the U.S. Billboard 200 at number 9 won several awards and achieved double platinum status after selling more than 2.5 million albums in the United States. The album spawned two top ten hits, Sugar, We're Going Down which reached number eight on the Billboard Hot 100 and has sold more than two million digital downloads in the U.S., and Dance, Dance, which peaked at number nine and certified platinum. To support the album, the band headlined tours around the world in 2005 and 2006. In 2007, the band released the follow-up album Infinity on High, to major chart success, debuting number one on the Billboard 200 with first week sales of 260,000. The album was certified platinum one month after its release. Infinity on High's lead single, This Ain't a Scene, It's an Arms Race reached number one on the defunct Pop 100 and number two on the Billboard Hot 100. The second single, THNKSFRTHMMRS, sold more than two million copies in the U.S. In 2008, the band released their fifth studio album, Folia De which debuted at number eight on the Billboard 200 with 150,000 first-week sales and was later certified gold. The band opened for Blink 182's 2009 reunion tour and shortly released their first greatest hits compilation album, Believers Never Die, Greatest Hits in November 2009 before announcing an indefinite hiatus. Patrick Stump embarked on a solo career and Pete Wentz created the DJ duo Black Cards. Truman and Fall Out Boy bandmate Andy Hurley started a band called The Damned Things with Anthrax members Scott Ian and Rob Giano and Every Time I Die vocalist Keith Buckley and bassist Josh Newton. They released their debut album in 2010, Ironic Cast. Truman then began work on a new band with Knives with Newton, releasing a debut EP, Schadenfreude in April 2012. In February 2013, Fall Out Boy reformed and became Truman's primary music focus. They released their comeback album, Say Rock and Roll, and toured year long in support of it. In October 2013, they released a new EP, Pax AM Days. Sixth studio album American Beauty American Psycho was released in January 2015, spearheaded by the platinum top 10 lead single Centuries. Equipment 
Trum and collects guitars, and has his own signature guitar made by Squier Guitars by Fender, the Joe Trum and Telecaster. Personal life, he is also a Star Wars enthusiast, and told StarWars.com, I still collect tons of action figures. My closet in my apartment is full of Euro 95% of Star Wars toys. Truman's house in Chicago was featured in a 2007 episode of MTV Crips. He married Marie Wertman Goebel in 2011. Their daughter Ruby was born on April 24, 2014. His mother died of a brain tumor on January 11, 2015. References External links Interview with Joe Truman at Guitar Vibe Interview with Joe Truman at Guitar Noise Interview at StarWars.com Joe Truman at the Internet Movie Database Joe Truman Fallout Boy Guitar Rig Diagram Anthrax Every Time I Die Fallout Boy Members Join Forces in the Damned Things